To become aware of my own sensuality, I first become fully aware of my own tactile sense. In dim light, I close my eyes and remove my clothes. his respect for being so wild? Hardly. He treats me like a rare and precious jewel, and he goes through the day proud of the fact that with me he is the world's most imaginative lover. Men pick amazing places for sexual adventure. The wildest adventure proposed to me was in a bathtub we would fill with jello. All I could think of was how many boxes it would take would be the most alluring color, the most delicious flavor, and how would that affect our oral explorations? If the jello gets firm, would I bounce? As you look around for what's new and different, remember these three important weapons that should be learned to keep a man in love. Imagination, sensitivity to his moods and desires, and the courage to experiment with new sexual techniques, enticing situations and places. Love making is physical, and so is its language. Suck, cock, fuck, and prick are not bad words. Used in the bedroom by lovers to describe parts of the body and physical activities, they are very proper indeed, and they distinctly enhance sex. Call a prudish attitude. Don't bristle and stick up your nose. At least, not up in the air. <laughs>